Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are. My name is Andrew Grosser and welcome to another edition of Rise and Grind. Today, I'm not going to waste any time in getting into this. We're just going to go straight for it and I'm going to say, be your own. That's right. Be your own legend. A lot of you are so busy sat there waiting. Waiting, twiddling your thumbs for someone to come along and give you permission. Waiting, twiddling your thumbs, waiting for someone else to come and live your life for you. Waiting, they're twiddling your thumbs, waiting for somebody else to decide on your own fate. Here it is. Your time happens when you make time to make it your time. When you make time out of your day to day to go, I'm going to focus on my dreams today and I'm going to set my plan in place to make them happen. To make shit kick off for me. To make my life what I want it to be. You're so focused on your J-O-B, you're so focused on your here and now, your future is not being nurtured. Your future is not being nurtured. When you take a look at, you take a look at the, 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 a garden, and you take a look at a garden and his flowers all in bloom. I put a post out this on my Instagram a little while ago. You're so busy, like these flowers themselves, but you're so busy taking into consideration, taking in the beauty and the awe of these flowers and the gardens and the ornaments and how everything's all placed together. Looking and going, wow, ain't that so beautiful? But that beauty started off with a thought process months ago. Where that farmer or that agriculturist sat, stood there and went, I can make this happen. I'm going to plant those over there and I'm going to plant those over there. I'm going to stick that gnome there and I'm going to plant that there. So that's going to wrap around him there. And I'm going to put that over there and I'm going to put that there. So many of you are so busy dealing with now. You're not attempting to plan for the future. And whilst I understand, believe you me, the urgency of things like bills, the urgency of things like dealing with your kids, the urgency of dealing with your other half or your ex-partner or holding on to the person that you think you need to hold on to for the rest of your life right now. You don't get it until you make time for tomorrow. Right now will always be right now. In other words, what you're in right now, how you're living right now, your circumstances right now, your cash flow situation right now, your other half right now, your life right now will always be your right now until you plan for it to be something different. Take time out for the future you and sow some seeds today. And when I say sow some seeds today, I don't necessarily mean go out there, go take the bank loan and get this thing started. I mean, pull up a chair, take out a notepad and take some notes as to what your head understand now, dreams of the future being. You'd be surprised in the power of writing something down. I'm talking about creating a spreadsheet and going, right, I understand what the dream is and going, right, well, what are the steps I need to take in order to make sure that dream happens in three, four, stroke, five years. That's what I mean by sowing the seeds right now and making the time for the future you right now. Until you do that, what you see now will always be what you see. Your future is yours to command, it's yours to control, it's yours to live, provided you're willing to put in the work for that future right now. The present is a present to those that are kicking, living and breathing enough to receive it. If you're re-watching this, you're kicking, living and breathing enough to receive the gift that is the present. But it's also your present to the future. Be your own. That's me out for another week. As usual, stay strong. Stay focused.